football there because we have a match to play. <laughs> you see swallowed so many fun facts, like visually. Mm. <laughs> and stop myself. Because we have here King versus Ishtar. Oh, and oh this Squirtle God. is already going in. Yep. What are you going to do about Sephiroth? What are you going to do about it? You're going to nair. You're going to do a lot of nair, and you're going to try and piece together with these back airs. But back airs can be so hard to land in, in a threatening area against Squirtle. Interesting down air, but you got to keep Squirtle second guessing. Okay. And those grabs will do a good job of it. Peppering back and forth, pressuring the platform. King couldn't get down immediately. Is taking a couple of back airs here now. Now at this point, do you stay Squirtle for the size advantage or uh, make a head? There it is. Oh, yeah, you need to that down air barely missing. But Wing is online. Here we go. Yeah, and at some point you might have. To, we may be seeing a switch to Charizard earlier than uh, than usually premeditated, mm -hmm. because while Razor Leaf is insane in a matchup oh my like this, God, just called out the jump. Yeah, Razor Leaf is great. The air speed of Sephiroth is, or the air speed of Ivysaur just isn't enough to keep a, uh, to keep a winged Sephiroth out. Oh yeah, 30% on, the wing is gone. Couldn't get down for the, couldn't get the down air in time. Now Octoslash Fly will do so it though. The key part about uh, about Charizard, while you can't, it, well it feels like you won't be able to stay Ivysaur and Charizard for long, they have two very key uh, points of where they are useful. Otherwise, staying Squirtle for a long time, I feel like it's the play, and that's what seems like King is going for. Okay. The water gun, down and air, there, oh, oh no, he didn't even, even Wow. I didn't realize how bad the drift on that was. Yeah, he drops, he plummets, he drops like a rock. Oh, that dash attack into up tilts. Just, only 23 though, hopefully you would find a grab instead, but King is just seemingly very comfortable just resetting with a lot of these single hits or multiple uh, multiple uh, out of shield or dash attack punishes. I mean, sometimes it's not. Wow, Woo! that that almost skewered him. Down smash is so good. You gotta go off here. No, he's charging flare. I get it, but also, it's Ivysaur. Ivysaur is the most out guardable out of them all. Maybe. Nah, Tether is pretty crazy actually. Yeah, it's probably Charizard, but especially with a counter. Maybe. Counter! He knew. We both knew. Everybody <laughs> knew. <laughs> if you don't know, then uh, shame on you. Wow. Yeah. 160, that four tilt, sweet spot. And you have wing for at least another 40-ish percent or so, but you're going at 40 percent damage dealt. Right. Could be more, actually, because the, as we see here, the deficit is certainly rising. Yeah, but... I don't think Wing is based on, it, Wing's not based on deficit, it's based on how much damage you deal right. with Wing. So it gets wonky. <laughs> which, which I do like is like a balancing mechanic, just so it's not so overpowering. It's not like Go. I no, have so many things to say about it. Go. <laughs> Backer comes in, 60% climbing. Oh, the Mega Flare's no. huge. Has a chance to go out there, try and throw out a fair. Yeah, Wing's still on deck, so Ishtar can afford to go out there and uh, make something happen. <laughs> you felt it. We both, we all felt it. Uh, I, we haven't seen it yet this game. But Tensions gotta rising. Gotta worry. Ooh, poked his toes and he's gone. He didn't even hit the toe. He hit the toenail. <laughs> Took at the reach. And oh, the well, we'll see that in a second. Deceptive hitbox of down smash. I was thinking because King was jumping so much, we might have seen like an up smash or an even an up tilt come out from right. Ishtar, but instead gets caught by that down smash, threatening King's shield. A landing with block is just not safe. Let's see that again. See how close that uh that was actually to hitting his toesies. Got to give it a moment. Here. Get a nice look at Ishtar. Take a sip. Welch's grape soda. Not a sponsor. I like grape. I'm a fan of grapes. Give me a fan to do. I'm about it. I would give I would give grapes like a solid eight out of ten. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's see this now. It was mad cold. Right there, jeez. Yeah, fortunately you won't be able to. Not, there it is. Like just playing that okay, grounded game so well, threatening with back air and then and boom, boom. like that that didn't hit. <laughs> right there. It hit like. How dare you stand in this general vicinity? Two, one, go. yeah, well, we got to see it going to uh, Smashville-esque stage, and 
Pokemon Trainer adores Smashville for that platform, and it's the same line, it's the same height here on Hollow Bastion. You just gotta make sure that your kill moves hit extra hard. Yes, yeah, it's FD Blast Zones is all. Yeah. Which does make a, it makes a fair bit of difference, to be quite honest. Hence why it's different from Smashville. But you get to play neutral similarly, and you get to play low percents similar, similarly. Though so King is certainly adjusting his game plan so far. Oh, yeah. Letting Squirtle do the talking, getting low to the ground. Okay. He's forward to calling out jumps with fair. And no IV change. Can you get? Mm, can punish the regrab. At this point, Squirtle, you're. Probably I saw that. That was cheeky. Yeah. With the kill percents, you're looking for forward tilt, or you're looking for a back throw, trying to set up a tech chase. Oh, Ooh, that's unfortunate. The star just yeah, dropping. Yeah, hate to dog. see it. Does the work for King. Now he can switch right back to Squirtle without having to worry about taking the stock and get I get the to ball. play as my favorite some more. Yeah, I can Hooray. just get the ball rolling. Down tilt. Okay, no grab. Caught the jump. Yeah, it looks like he's about to. Was yeah, he was about to position himself for another dare. Yeah. Instead of just taking the damage. Okay. There's these up airs gonna come out pretty early. That counter was huge. Now, if he can get a kill, on, I was about to say, on the next interaction, Wing might not come out and he'll die for it, but it is out now. Okay, managed to get away from that very uh, swiftly. A lot right. of ledge drop fares here, though. Oh, and another You gotta respect smash. the armor. Yeah, too much to, in order to just throw out Razor Leaf haphazardly, but the Squirtle comes out yet again. King sticking to the game plan, knowing that Squirtle gives uh, gives Ishtar and can give Sephiroth the most trouble. Down tilt? No, going for grab that time and get spot dodge for it. Getting all the jumps and recovering all the Very way nice. up. Wow, just super tunneled on that high recovery. Burning jumps early and getting hard punished for at the end. There's so much to say about when a character can force you to recover a way you don't want to, and Water Gun oh, yeah. is putting in the work. Water gun mixed with Ivysaur. Okay, like I like the surf. Almost did it again. Doing it quite as such. You can dash back all the way you want, but now you're just in the other side. King doing a great job of forcing Ishtar into just terrible positions by sheer movement. But Ishtar Fourth has throw. a trap of his own. All right, let her rip. Ooh, flare Blitz. Switch. Oh, okay. <laughs> I wanted it. <laughs> I don't think it would have killed, but it would have sent but a it message. It would have been a lot of damage. <laughs> That's what I call big damage. Yeah. Both mental and percent wise. The back throw. Do oh. oh, that back air almost went missed. Almost hit, rather. Just barely missing it. Now you lose so much off it. Ishtar throwing out a ton of rolls, ton of dashes, but that fair comes in. Has enough jumps, but Didn't not Didn't matter any anyway. Yeah, that neutral air was. Perfect because of the that cinched the game. Yeah. The jump routes on recovery have been very telegraphed from Ishtar, as we'll get to see in both the second uh, this stock here, not this stock here, the the one, the next one, this one, because he gets thrown off stage. There's a water gun. Burns both jumps immediately into an immediate high recovery, is just showing the tunnel vision on Ishtar's part. And now here, as we like, we'll watch those both jumps and and the nair comes in. But I think what's so prevalent is the fact that we get to watch we get to watch uh, Ishtar go the yep. same route immediately. Don't save resources, just go go. And once you use and both, look where it got you. Yeah, once you're using them both right away like that, you lose so much power of Sephiroth of saving that third jump for your recovery mix-ups. Ishtar can't hear us, but hopefully, you know. Offstage interactions won't be as easily read. Town and city. You that got is, a lot to that work is, of with. course, assuming that uh, Ishtar gets sent off stage because uh, opening this game with a bit of a lead. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. I do like boy, the boy charge though, but it got him into some very, very tense scenarios. Gets a nair out of shield. Oh, into the forward air as well. These platforms are going to do so much about just keeping King off balance. Another Nair doesn't go for up air though, and just is missing some of these follow ups. Plenty of starters, no finisher. Instead, we're just playing neutral. 
I don't, know, I don't know if that's a sign of just him not believing in it or just wanting to, you know what, it's working, let me not uh, stray too far from the golden path. Yeah, it might be like a setup thing or just barely missing that blade charge as well. Gets the forward throw into Mega Flare. Another one. Just re rather rinse, repeat, that and almost, reset. That almost hit. That will, oh, Charizard's a big boy. Probably won't live another one, though. Out of it, block. Just that interesting, was in, that interesting was the uh, sweet spot. Yeah, just tools coming back and forth, but gotta wonder about a couple of options from King. Just went in with the dash attack, and it works. Worked again, but that air dodge, we'll, we'll talk about it a little bit later, but there's yeah. a couple times where King has gone from jump from ledge into landing air dodge. I did notice that. Very. From, it's odd. It's ill advised. Yes, yeah, so that's definitely the word I would go for. Still, King needing to do a ton with this stock right now. And Sephiroth, not getting touched with Squirtle thus far. Yeah, Sephiroth is light, so. Oh my god, that, that could have been it if he got the jab lock. Could have been. Tech chases are where Squirtle gets almost all of their kills. I, I, like, I've been on record saying this before. If Squirtle had like a legitimate kill confirmed that wasn't reliant on the opponent not teching, this character goes up so many tiers. Oh, yeah. And they're already top 15. <laughs> Pokemon trainers are nuts. Just getting a forward air instead of back air there. As he just ran up and grabbed Ishtar, just playing with so much confidence now that they have a, wing. Definitely putting the fear in King right now. Okay. With wing and a stock lead, they can play to their strengths, but that jump call out is going to show off Sephiroth's main weakness, as you were mentioning, Sonic Queen. Just that weight means that no lead is ever truly safe. Uh, resetting on the platform, gets the jump call out with the up air, double jump used. Good spacing on the part of Ishtar keeps them away from most of these dangerous situations. Dash attack after dash attack, catching so many landings. Oh boy. It's hard to catch a tether recovery for down Okay, go use the play dash. Gonna catch the landing. Barely. That was that up to By the skin of his scales, I tell you. We won't be seeing another up to for probably a good long while at this point. Not going for the, well, both sides just trying to get a, a punish in the corner. And wow. there it is off of that lingering forward air. Active Stabbed for them just right long. in the tail. Look at Mewtwo up in here. DI'd up in order to avoid the tech chase scenario. Good stuff from uh, from Ishtar. Playing around Squirtle's main win condition here, and is you're only getting 13%, but you're also not losing too much ground. Plus, with that speed of wing, you're able to threaten Squirtle. And it's threatened the entirety of Pokemon Trainer just about in any position on the stage, despite how big Town and City is. Look at him. He's, they're it's in their face. King has to pull. Oh, my God. Like, I'm going cross stage, and I'm up airing you, and I'm King has to play perfectly. You saw that, right? That was that was definitely an up smash of some sort coming out. And yes. right in the chest, the set goes to Ishtar with a dominating, for lack of a better term, game three, honestly. Yeah, super well played. On he, like, he, he recognized his faults and what cost him game two. It's like, you know what? I'm better than that. I got ninth last week. Let me show you how I did it. He's put, into, put together a suite of solid openers, was able to pressure in just the right positions, able to call out landings very well with dash attacks, and go more willing, playing with just more willingness and more confidence to show off what makes Sephiroth so good, and that fear was so important on keeping King off balance. Having them go for a lot more air dodges, a lot more stray aerials. It's like keep you guess, keeping them guessing throughout the entire basically the entirety of that game as soon as the first stock was dropped. Absolutely true, and nothing like nothing bad to say on King's end. King no. played that as well as he could, I think. Just, you know, sometimes just the better player, like, adjusts faster than you can probably account for. Right. And it seems like it would be natively, it was natively tough to stick Squirtle as the longer that set went. And that was really important to the game plan that King had available to them because Squirtle was such a cornerstone in it. But then saw a lot with the lead and Squirtle's lack of raw kill power coming in and hurting hurting King very hard and the speed of wing just able to get in your face grab you up throw like up we, throw we were, there, we were boom, just we're talking done. about it like before the set started like wing absolutely changes the changes. entire matchup 
changes the entirety of how you play against the character and its adjustments that are yes, hard to, to like make. You on are the fly. forced to respect so much. Like oh, again, yeah. similar to Arsene, difference between those two being like one lasts throughout a stock into the next. The other, you can get multiple times a stock if you know what you're doing. Right. Or if the opponent's just throwing things out, they shouldn't. No. <laughs> Sometimes people press a lot of buttons in this game. It's pretty I mean, it's pretty this, good. Is, <laughs> this is a game where, unless your name is Kazuyo Mishima, you have a frame three jump squad. Everyone's mashing buttons. We want our big boy aerials out here. That's a big green. Look at this. It's Well, it's not a, it's not green on my controller, but this is a big button, guys. <laughs> I, I want, want to press, press it. 